Isaac, yeah. come on. Aren't you going in to buy presents? Actually, I was, I was thinking about hanging back just so I could save my money. No, just in case there's something I need that I didn't get for Christmas. What? Yeah, I know how it is. You guys never give me what I want. Are you kidding me? You know it's always better to give than to receive, don't you? Get your behind in here and buy your dad and your sister something nice. Let's go. Mom, you always get them something to write my name on the package. Can you just do that again? Why do we have to start spending my money? Better to give than to receive, loser. Let's go. It's better to give than to receive, loser. <sighs> Said that already. Oh, thanks, man. Merry Christmas. God bless. Your sign's upside down. You hear me? Your sign's upside down. It's upside down. You gotta flip. flip it. Do you really have a family? Because my dad says you're probably just gonna waste the money on beer or drugs. Is that what you think? I probably wouldn't give you any money because you look like you might use it for those things. How am I supposed to look? I don't know. I think if I put on a suit and tie, somebody would stop and help me? Maybe they give you a job. Job, huh? All right. You got a job you want to give me? No. Oh, well. Where is your family? You said you have one, didn't you? All these questions because my sign was upside down? I just want to know if you really need help. Doesn't sound like you're interested in helping me. Sounds like you want to judge me. Doesn't everybody want to when they drive by? They sure don't have this many questions. They either help me or they don't. Yeah, but they still think it, don't they? Let me ask you a question. You saw a man and he was drowning and pleading for help. Would you help him? Or would you stop to ask yourself whether or not he was worth saving? No, I mean, if he didn't need help, he wouldn't be drowning. See that car right over there? That's where my family is. It's just temporary. Hey, where are you going? My job. I thought you said you didn't have a job. I don't. Hey. Hey, buddy. I think people are just trying to get in the store. They're not trying to buy salvation. What's that? That is what you're selling, right? Salvation? Sort of, but, I mean, not to them. Well, then to who? It's for people who really need it. Like the guy you were talking to earlier. You know, I see a lot of people here every day, right there on the corner asking for help. I don't know, something about him. He's special. See, he speaks to every man, no matter the circumstance. I don't understand. See, it doesn't matter what his personal story is or how he got there, kid. He always puts his family and others before him. How does he do that? You'll see. He always gives back for all his blessings, no matter how big or how small. Wouldn't it be nice if we all live like that? Hey, buddy. We got you covered. Put your head on to your family. All right, have fun. Oh, you might need this. See you, kid. Given to those who are less fortunate. God already gave us what we needed for the day, so doing my part. And who knows, maybe tomorrow I'll get that shirt and tie that you suggested and get myself a job. <laughs> hey, you know what? You, you wait here. Okay, I'll be right back. Got nowhere to go. Merry Christmas. No need. No need for what? No need for you to wear that suit. I got you a job. What? I'm Bob. John. Come with me. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> well, hello. <clears throat> hey, I have to tell you, this is not how I expected my day to end, but I just want to say thank you. Mine either. You're welcome. <clears throat> 
Young man, how about you uh, sit right here on Santa's lap and tell me what you would like for Christmas? Already? You know, there's really just one thing. You know, Mom, you were right. It's better to give than to receive.